We've reached a point in some places where the, the more explicit forms of inequality are, are easier to identify. We can count the number of people in a room and identify when it's unequal. I think what's harder is identifying the more implicit underlying assumptions and behaviors that influence our own decisions and knowing where they come from. There's kind of this idea that men and women are different and actually looking back and understanding that from birth we're treated differently. So actually if from birth we were treated the same, maybe our brains would develop the same way. Maybe we would be equally good at spatial awareness as well as empathy and, and caring. Girls and women sometimes lack the confidence to say or to go for that, that leadership position. They're making that decision for themselves, but the, the underlying reasons for why they don't have the confidence to go for that job is also part of the responsibility of all of us to make sure that, that that's not a gender issue. This year for International Women's Day, um, we've got a few things to, to highlight. We've got lots of different discussions and activities going on in tutor groups and tutor, tutor bases. We've had our International Women's Day assembly with a guest speaker. The tutor groups are all working now on writing pledges, making promises about how they can promote gender equality in our school and support it. And we're going to put them up on a pledge wall. And we are going to be screening Chimamanda Adichie's We Should All Be Feminist TED Talk. Happy International Women's Day.